Um, and finally, we got Roman Reigns versus Cody Rhodes for the undisputed heavyweight title. Um, I think how we're talking, oh, we all believe Cody Rhodes will win. Yeah. Basically, see, see, I went with. I think we all going. No oh, wait. <laughs> see, this is one. Of, this is one of those. I'm, I'm head, this is one of those head versus heart. Head versus heart decisions. Because my heart is. Because my heart is saying go Cody Rhodes. Because I actually want to see it happen. But my mm-hmm. but my head is saying for the mm-hmm. purposes of the story, it almost makes sense that someone in the bloodline is the one that they thrown to. But but um. Ah, yeah, I, I gotta go. I'm, I'm gonna go, Cody. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna take my heart on this one. Yeah, yeah, I'm. I'm sorry if they if, and I guess Cody was also talking about this. Um, that it was a bigger gamble to come back to WWE than it was to actually leave and go mm-hmm. do his own shit like he did with AEW. And yeah, yeah I'm yeah. sorry if he doesn't win the title at WrestleMania. I feel like that's the biggest. Like, well. I, I yes, I'm gonna say biggest because it's fucking WrestleMania. I don't need to see him win at fucking SummerSlam. I need him to win a fucking WrestleMania, you know. But yes, knowing <laughs> them, they could pull a big old fuck you. We're gonna keep Roman, <laughs> you know. Triple H was seen- a long term time running heel champion. <laughs> he awesome was that thing. guy. If there was he anybody was. to bury somebody for a long time, I'm sorry. Maybe, just, but wait, wait, wait. Cody guy. Rhodes. We we know how WWE gets. Does it? They bury people. They hey, you you wronged us in the past. We put you down. <laughs> You're yeah, gonna yeah, pay your dues. Was, yeah, but there was You're a specific. Yeah, but there was a specific <laughs> seventy year old billionaire behind that shit with Triple H. <laughs> so he's remember, still behind it. <laughs> he's still behind it. He's just giving advice, all right. He's just giving advice. <laughs> again, I, again, they as, as I said, we I've said on this podcast many times, they can't Lex express them. They can't. <laughs> oh yeah, you have to say Lex express them. They have to follow through on it and give him that credible yeah. win at WrestleMania. Yeah, like, exactly. You said it like David. The yeah, they've, story. Like they've invested. Yeah, they've invested too much money into him. Who God knows how much they're paying Cody, and then you know give him the win at Royal Rumble. Yes, he wasn't like the number one spot, but still, after the injury, coming back, winning, all the shit talking with Roman and his dad and Paul Heyman, like promos have been awesome. Just, <laughs> yeah. They've been top notch. Yeah. And, um, and I think that was one of the things that we were worried about. Like, is Cody going to be able to carry himself against Roman in these things? Paul Heyman, and he's he's yeah. delivered on his end. Yeah, he has delivered. Great. Like, it's been like great. you don't. There's no questions about Cody Rhodes. Like there's mm-hmm. no questions right now about Cody Rhodes. Yeah. So they can't let's express him. They can. If they do that, I guess it continues the underdog role storyline. But it's like, nah, we need this to happen. <laughs> what, do you, what do you? How do you even redeem him at that point? Like, because then it's like everything Roman said until that point is true, and he's no, yep. he's not going to be seen as a main eventer. Yeah, well, it also depends on how he loses. He loses too. I mean, if the whole bloodline yeah. gets involved, and he's pretty much fighting. Yeah. Like, but if he loses him. clean, he can't lose clean. You he might can't as lose well like have the Cesaro. shovels there. You might as well have he can't the lose like, there he, can't lo- he can't lose like Cesaro. He can't do that. <laughs> he can't do that. You can't lose clean with that. Like if he's gonna go out, he's got to go out on the shield like some type of uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. I'm bleeding. <laughs> like I took yeah. all like I can handle like that's the way like he goes out like I think yeah. about like um uh, uh WCW when uh Diamond Dallas paid like this is weird but like old like his the last pay per view of WCW uh he was facing Scott Steiner and he basically got beat to a pulp and got submitted out and didn't tap out and like that was the end of him like that was it <laughs> like he's got to he's got to go out like brutal <laughs> like mm-hmm. he can't just like go out clean or like some small finish like a low blow he can't do that <laughs> they can't do that if they're going to have roman win he's got to be like destroyed like something has yeah. bad as that <laughs> like we're to the point where we don't know if cody rhodes is coming back or something like that to that extent but um again they can't lex express him they built up this perfectly cody rhodes has come back and been a force of fire and if anything, if, if anybody's going to beat Roman Reigns right now, I don't see anybody else on the card right now that they have built up even close to doing that. It has to be. It has to be Cody Rhodes. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love America now, and <laughs> America. Oh, so I love America. Let me ask this. Let me ask this question. So when mm-hmm. Cody initially came back at last year's WrestleMania, 
was do you did you guys kind of have the thought that if anybody's gonna t- gonna dethrone Roman, it has to be co- it has to be him now? Initially, when he first came back, I thought this this is my thought. I thought he was going to dethrone him at SummerSlam. I thought that was the original plan. Like so he was yeah, building up against mm-hmm. Seth and then going to go into SummerSlam. Uh, where were they in Tennessee, Nashville? Nashville, yeah. He, he has the red, white, and blue on. Country folk, like he's in that element. Perfect time to win. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like I, uh, I, I didn't like Brock Lesnar came back and he lost right, like at, at SummerSlam, right <laughs> when he flipped the ring. All yeah, that, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> like that was crazy. Like again, great moment, but I'm like, I don't think that was the original plan, and I feel like they just audible because Cody got hurt. Yeah, but I thought that at SummerSlam it would have been the perfect time for him to actually come back and win it. Has that that trio match against Seth comes back and then does that. So that that's how I thought it was going to go. Mm-hmm. Nice, nice. Right. Um, but yeah, we're going Cody Rhodes on that last one there. Um, where do we have a consensus? Can I put this in here? Let me see if I can put this in here. All right, so our picks for the, the matches, obviously the women's showcase. Me and Brian have Raquel Rodriguez and Liv Morgan. Uh, Lewis has Ronda and Baszler for the men's showcase. You guys have Braun and Ricochet. I have the Street Profits. Uh, Brock Lesnar and Omos. You guys have Omos. I have Brock Lesnar. We all have damage control in that uh, three-on-three tag match with Trish, Lita, and Becky. Uh, me and Lewis are going Rey Mysterio. Brian's going Dominic Mysterio. Uh, Bianca Belair in the Raw Women's title match against Asuka. Me and Brian have Asuka. Lewis has Bianca Belair. You guys have Seth Rollins, even though I think you guys are wrong. I'm going Logan Paul in that matchup. <laughs> we have no more punch. <laughs> Get that shit out of here. We have, a, we have a sweep on the next three matches. We're all going Austin Theory against John Cena. Going Gunther in the Intercontinental title matchup. We're going Finn Balor and Rhea Ripley. The next four matches we have that going on. Um, you guys have Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn. I have the Usos. And a sweep at the end here, we have Cody Rhodes um, winning the Universal Heavyweight title at WrestleMania, closing that out. Um, can't wait to see it. WrestleMania is going to be epic. We have two nights there. Uh, we don't. We, I think we have some matches that we know are night one and then night two where they're still trying to figure out. So we'll see how that goes coming up on WrestleMania.